Small business owners are speaking out as their communities face destruction at the hands of violent protesters. One America's Jen Pellegrino sat down with a business owner and former NFL star Jack Brewer. Joining me now is Jack Brewer, professor at Fordham University, CEO of the Brewer Group, and of course, former NFL. Jack, thanks so much for taking time to be with us. Thanks for having me. Obviously, right now, America is going through a lot. You know, we're seeing a lot of uh, violence and destruction in the wake of the tragic death of George Floyd. Jack, what's going through your mind when you turn on the TV and you see what's happening across the country? Sadness. Um, you know, try to control my my anger through my faith, um, but it's, it's sadness, you know, and it, it really has caused me uh, to go to the only thing that can help us heal, uh, and that's the Word of God. So, um, you know, when I look out across and, you know, you see so many peaceful protesters, I mean, the vast majority of people are out there uh, to honor the name of George Floyd and uh, to ask for change systematically uh, in our policing, uh, but then you have these looters and these rioters who uh, are changing that conversation and overshadowing the narrative uh, and in a lot of ways disrespecting um, what George Floyd was all about. Jack, you mentioned the, the peaceful protesters being overshadowed in all of this. Who and what do you think is, is really behind some of the violence that we've seen? You know, I think you have rogue groups. Um, I think, you know, whenever you, 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 you watch that police officer kill, uh, you watch Satan. Um, and now when you're seeing these people burning churches and burning businesses, you're also watching Satan. Uh, and so you're seeing evil uh, all around us right now. And I think the groups that are behind this know what they're doing. I think this is planned out. The leaders need to realize this is not the time to score political points. This is not the time uh, to get your ratings up. This is not the time to, to, to say uh, things and, and get uh, your, your lines out to fundraise. Uh, this is not the time for that. This is the time to come together, to come together as one nation under God. Jack, unfortunately, we've seen, you know, black-owned businesses destroyed as well. We saw uh, retired St. Louis police captain David Dorn shot and killed. Um, how do we move forward? How do we come together as a nation and, and have a conversation and see progress out of this? First, we got to do what the Bible says, and the, and the Bible says, comfort those that are troubled the way that Christ comforts us, uh, and that's Second Chronicles 1 and 4, and we have to actually do that. Uh, we can't, you can't have people combating right now politically during a spiritual battle, uh, and the second step is we need real reform. We need real reform. Police officers across America agree that we need reform. 99 0.9% of police officers are amazing men and women of God going out there protecting and serving. They don't think that a, a cop like this should uh, be uh, an example of what they represent. They are outraged right now. We are all outraged, but we have to do something about it. Before we can get justice, we have to have truth. And the only way you find truth is through the word of God, the rightly dividing the word of truth. And for us to really come to truth, in America, we have to have the hearts of Christ. We have to have the, the love for our neighbor, the true love for our neighbor that breaks the barrier of race. Well said. Jack Brewer, thank you so much for taking time to be with us. It's always great to have you. Thank you. God bless you. God bless you. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One America News on YouTube. And call your cable provider and kindly demand that One America News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.